Hi, I'm Jake from TradeLive.ai. In this video, we're going to show you how easy it is to connect trading view strategies up to TradeLab. First thing we're going to do is use the pre-made trading view strategy template by clicking on the community strategies on the left side and then scrolling down to the generic trading view template. It's got a nice colorful picture for it, so it's easy to find. Press the copy button and then press yes. Using this generic trading view template, we can set up any trading view strategy that supports backtesting out of the box. All we have to do is press edit. This will bring up the strategy builder and strategy setup wizard. It'll ask us to set up our strategy, press do it now. It'll ask us to select our exchange. If you haven't set one up, you can set that up in the settings screen on the left side. And then it'll ask us to set up our symbol I'll select Bitcoin today. Press continue. Now it'll show us instructions on how to set up our alert. If we press the strategy alert, it'll tell us to open up TradingView and create a new alert. So if we go over to TradingView, let's first start by making sure that we have the correct symbol selected and the correct exchange selected. I have Bitcoin and Bybit. And then we'll open the indicator and select the strategy that we want to use. Today, I'm going to be using Johnny's bot, which is a free trading view strategy. If you click your strategy, it'll load up. And now we can click the create alert button. And now we can go back over to trade lab and it'll give us instructions for the condition. We need to select our strategy. So if we go over to trading view and under condition, we select Johnny's bot. We can then see that nothing pops up, so we don't have to worry about the second line. And then it'll ask us for a webhook URL. So if we click on this box, it'll copy the webhook, and then we can paste that into the webhook box. The next thing it'll ask us for is our alert name. We can just copy this and paste this into our alert name. And then it'll ask us for a message. Trade Lab generates messages for you and helps you build them as you're building your alert. I'm going to go ahead and paste this in, press create. And now we have my Johnny's bot uh, alert set up right here. If we go back to Trade Lab, we can press back and all done. And now our alert is set up. The next thing we need to worry about is how much we want to trade. If we look under trade settings, we can set our trade amount. If I set 50 with an amount type of USD, that's going to be $50 for every trade. If I change this to coin and then say one, that's going to be one Bitcoin on every trade, which would make my estimated margin size 35,000. Okay. If I wanted to say percentage and say trade 5% of my balance, that would give me an estimated margin size of $42, an estimated order size of 0 0.001 Bitcoin with the reference price of 35,000. If I change my leverage to times 10, we can see that the estimated order size uh, gets multiplied and the margin size stays the same. All right, we can also select our order type. We can do market or limit. If we do limit, we can change our time and force between uh, immediate or cancel, fill or kill, or good till close. We also offer post only for exchanges that support it. We can select good till close which will leave it open and allow it to fill. But if it doesn't fill for a certain amount of time, we want to close it. So if we go to advanced settings, we can change the limit timeout. This is hours, minutes, and seconds. So I can change this to one minute, and now it'll open up a limit order. And after one minute, if that hasn't been filled, it will cancel the order. Okay, we can also set up a limit offset type. So if you wanted to offset your limit order from the current price by a certain percentage or by a fixed USD amount relative to the current price, you can do that. If you wanted to give a exact USD price, an exact price of where you want to enter, you can do that as well. And that's the basics of setting up a trading view strategy. When using a trading view strategy, it's automatically going to send alerts based on when you enter and exit trades on trading view. We will mimic that by entering longs and shorts and listening for an enter and an exit alert. Trading view strategies that support backtesting 
should handle this appropriately and there should be very little setup. The only setup you may have to do is creating your TPSL lines. So if you go under Take Profit, you can hit Configure TPSL and you can create different uh, Take Profit and Stop Loss lines. For more information about this, check out our multiple Take Profit and Stop Loss video. So now that we're done with that, we can go ahead and hit save and exit. And now we can see our generic trading view template is set to Bitcoin and it's running, it's looking for entry. So it is ready to go. And that's how easy it is to set up trading view templates in TradeLab. There's a whole lot more to this. You can go very deep. You can send information from trading view to TradeLab, uh, making it send dynamic information such as your take stop lines. Uh, or, or where you want to uh, enter a trade. If you're interested in learning more about that, take a look at some of the other videos we've done. If you have any other questions, feel free to join us on Discord. You can also click on the help button at the bottom right of any page. You can ask any questions and read help articles here or click here to create a support ticket. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more updates and have a great day.